All right, guys, so we got uh, some rice, some broccoli, some sauce, and we're probably gonna do some chicken as well in here and mix it up then. Hey guys, welcome back to Unboxing with Scott. So for today's video, we're checking out this cooking pot. So, I'm excited to try it out because, well, I hate to admit it, but I'm starving. So, I thought, you know, this would be a great time to do a review on when you're hungry with something. So, let's unbox it and show you what you get. All right, guys, there's a lot to dig in. Uh, they make a lot, they give you a lot of stuff. So, you get a spatula, you get a manual, you get your lid. So this is the lid that would go on. Um, they give you your bracket for the lid. So they give you the handle and that just goes right on. And we're, we're gonna actually do that right here, right now. It's actually a really nice looking handle. Um, so you got two different washers here. We're going to drop this in here this little piece. So that's gonna go right down in here. The little rubber piece goes right in the glass right there. Um, your handle is gonna go like this and we're going to take our screw that they provide us with and we're gonna run that up through. So we're actually gonna just hold it right there and put this rubber piece right through it. And now the handle is just gonna set on top and thread in. So uh, while you're holding the screw with your one finger, just thread in the handle. Again, don't go crazy tight because you don't wanna crack the glass. So now you're gonna want a screwdriver. So this is very important. Um, as we screw this on, you wanna make sure that it's tight, but you don't crack the glass. So, very important step. This is the most important step out of all of it. So that's what the rubber piece is there for. But we're gonna make it tight. You can kind of hear a little cr cracking going on. That That's when you're good to go. You just stop. You kind of hear the glass a little bit. You stop, that's where you stop. And it will rotate around. Um, you know, it can rotate. And I guess you could go tighter. Yeah, you can go tighter. It's just a little scary, so be careful. Um, so there, you know, that's the handle now is on. So for this, again, it's simple. Standard plug plugs into your standard wall. They give you uh, mittens or heating pad, gloves, um, however you want to call them. Also, it looks like a cleaning cloth probably for the glass. Uh, let's see here. This is, again, they give you the manual. This is your actual, um, so the pan. So what, how this works, make sure you get um, all the stuff off your pan. So sometimes there's little packaging in there. Get that all off. And you set this down like this and it heats up this pan. And then this pan, you just take your lid with it like this, just like that, and you're good to go. So it sets like that, lift off to check your food, and pull off the pan, and you're good to go. This never gets food in it, never, you know, never gets dirty, so uh, that's nice. So how this works is it has a L and an N. So let's see if they mark it on here or not. Doesn't look like they do. Um, but obviously, you know, the remote, the temperature knob would face up. So that's how it would go. Um, and you just slide that in like this. So once it's slid in, you then have a thermostat and you have these different levels that you can set it to um, all the way up to number five. So zero to five for the temperature. Make sure it's always off past the zero point. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and heat some food up. 
I'm getting hungry. I'll make some food. So, yeah. So far, so good. This also lights up orange, letting you know it's on. Once you go down to off, it goes off, letting you know it's off. So, we'll chop the chicken up then once it's cooked and mix it in. So, our rice and... Um, our rice and broccoli is going to be done sooner, so what we'll do is we'll put that in a heated container and let it sit, and then once our chicken's done, we will then go ahead and do it at the same time. I only, it's only going to be different because the chicken is frozen while the other stuff was not frozen. So, guys, I'm loving this so far. Absolutely love it. It's working perfect. So, guys, I decided I like this so much. I decided to add some different... Uh, noodles make my own little meal here. I, I absolutely love this. It gets a Scott pass guys. It gets a Scott pass 